more than 8,000 years, man has been using wool to improve the quality of his life, keep warm, and protect himself from the elements. Today, this renewable and biodegradable fiber is just as important and highly valued for its natural properties. Every year, more than one billion sheep from around the world produce more than one million tons of clean, raw wool that is used not only in the fashion industry, but in many other products. Wool provides insulation and better acoustics for buildings. It's naturally flame resistant due to its unique structure and is an ideal fiber when it comes to fire safety. Wool doesn't melt, drip or stick to the skin when it burns. And it doesn't produce toxic fumes, the kind of properties that are important in architecture, aviation, transport and military services. Wool's many natural properties have made it a popular fiber with endless possibilities. It's used to produce sports and outdoor products, bedding, carpets, medical textiles, and even technical filters, to name just a few. Wool is considered the ideal fiber for cold weather conditions. It can retain heat while wet and perform well under severe weather conditions. One reason why wool is chosen by mountain rescuers as the ultimate performance fabric. And it's not just in cold temperatures where wool comes into its own. In hot climates, due to its breathability, it can transport moisture vapor away from your skin and keep you cool. The main wool producing countries are Argentina, Uruguay, Australia and New Zealand, South Africa, China, the US and the UK. Once the wool leaves the farm, it goes on a long journey along the wool supply chain. Each bale of wool gets tested to define its exact properties, such as fiber length or how fine it is. After testing, the wool is ready to be sold either at the farm gate or at auction. Most wool gets exported to major wool processing countries, including China and India, and several European countries. But before the wool can be knitted or woven into fabrics, it must be processed. There are several steps. These include washing, carbonizing, carding, combing, spinning, and dyeing. Wool is not just seen as a much-valued fiber, but a precious resource, and sustainability is at the heart of the modern wool industry. The International Wool Textile Organization represents the interests of the wool textile trade at a global level, and membership of the IWTO encompasses the entire wool textile pipeline from farm to retail. Its mission is to ensure a sustainable future for wool. How wool is produced is as important to growers as the end quality of the product. They know that only healthy and happy sheep grow high quality wool. That's why they've signed up to five freedoms at the core of the IWTO's wool sheep welfare specifications. They include freedom from hunger, thirst and malnutrition, freedom from discomfort, freedom from pain, injury and disease, freedom to express normal patterns of behavior, freedom from fear and distress. But it's not just animal welfare that's important to the wool industry. Taking good care of the environment and acting sustainably is a concern to wool growers and wool companies alike. Growers manage the land and sheep responsibly to increase biodiversity on their farms and reverse desertification. And wool processing companies continuously invest in their facilities to meet high environmental regulations and reduce the consumption of water, energy and chemicals. Wool is one of the most sustainable products around and at the end of its life, wool can easily be reused and recycled into new products. It's also biodegradable. Such natural properties make wool the fibre of choice for a modern, healthy and sustainable lifestyle.